solve an quadratic equation and just be mindful that this negative 5 is not under the radical. So the first thing we're going to want to do is isolate the radical, so we're going to add 5. So we have radical 3x squared plus 10x is equal to positive 5. Now this is when we're going to get rid of our radical by squaring both sides. So radical and exponent cancels out, we're left with 3x squared plus 10x is equal to positive 25. Now we're going to bring 25 over and set the equation equal to zero. So we have 3x squared plus 10x minus 25 is equal to zero. So this is what we're focusing on factoring. And I'm gonna use the AC method where I multiply A and C. So we have x squared plus 10x minus 75 is equal to zero. So when we're at this step right here, we're looking for two factors that multiply to give us 75, add to give us 10. So we're gonna have x plus 15 times x minus five. And the reason why students get this wrong is because they forget to come back and divide by that same factor they multiplied. So we're gonna divide both of these by three. X plus 15 simplifies to x plus five is equal to zero. So my first factor is x is equal to negative 5. And in the second factor, because we don't get a whole number when we divide 5 by 3, we're going to take 3 and put it in front of the x. So we have 3x minus 5 is equal to 0. We add 5 on both sides to get 3x is equal to 5. And then once we divide, we're going to get x is equal to 5 over 3 as a second factor.